Guys, so I had a great opportunity to catch up with my friend Kev as he's down at one of my local tracks. So we had a chance to have a look over the N1, see how it drives, and here's my little review. And if you have noticed, we've got the original t-shirt, dug it out of the drawer, M1 baby. Okay, so first thing is first, we are missing some crucial components, but alas, they are not required because the N1, even without the shock towers, is absolutely dialed. You can see here, lay down shocks, ultra, ultra low center of gravity. It makes the N1 super consistent to drive. And after seeing it on the track for the first time today, wow it goes through the corner like lightning super flat it jumps absolutely awesome it was the only buggy i've seen today to make the triple and it made it easily super impressive you can see here just how low everything is to the chassis barely barely above the shocks super low you can really feel that on the track. The rear wing mount, a work of art. You can see here going up the straight just how flat the car sits over the bumps, how it jumps. Absolutely awesome. Here we go for the triple. Easy. Look how flat the car landed. Really impressive through that corner. So overall, today from what I've seen, epic, epic car. Certainly driving wise, changed the centre diff and super easy. There's lots to this car that I haven't talked about because this isn't a full review. This was just what I've seen and enjoyed today. But the access to the diffs, how free the drivetrain is, how it drove through the corner, through the air, super impressed. Maybe we should get one to try. What do you think? Let me know in the comments.